Sorry. Good morning. My name is Wayne. This is DGS Golf Vlogs, and welcome to the channel. Playing with these guys today. What a treat. Right. Just a free ball. Just no, a free ball. We just come for the Starbucks and we're going. I don't, no, I don't blame them at all. Uh, we're playing Old Thorns today. I love this course. Amazing track. Amazing clubhouse. Covid restrictions. Everything sort of shut. Pro shops open and things to do. Takeaways. Um, such a cool place. This. I love this course. Had so much rain overnight though, so I'm expecting the course to be pretty damp out there. Um, Something different today, we're gonna to do three ball team game. So we're not playing against each other, we're all on the same team. And uh, we're gonna basically see how low we can shoot playing better balls. So we'll play our own balls and the best score on each hole carries forward. And we'll see if we can beat Pat. I think that'll be quite good. Five under? Yeah. You reckon? Five under's the goal? Yeah. He didn't see what happened the other day. <laughs> five under's the goal. Outrageous. I mean, we do have Stu with us. Yeah. So five under so could be achieved. Five under. do you know Although what I mean? two practice sessions this week, a month off, we'll see. Yeah, it'll be fine then. Absolutely Easy. fine. <laughs> Six under. Yeah, there you go. Optimism. Uh, I'd like to think we'd be under par. I really would like to think that. If we're not, I'd be disappointed. Really? Yeah, I would. Yeah, I, I, I think I, we definitely I, should make right, par. Let's just a five again. Can we? <laughs> yeah, that's right. Yeah, we completely agree. Can't we, help it. I know, but it's going to be wet out there. Isn't it? There's a lot of rain overnight. Yeah, it drains doing, well they're, they're here. They've been doing but, the drainage work as well. Have they? He said so they've been uh, investing. The first, there's a bit of ground under repair where they've been doing drainage work. He said otherwise, of course, it's in really good nick at the moment. Well, that does sound fantastic. So. Well, six under. <laughs> rain has started coming down can't believe it hopefully it's just a little misty shower and then uh, it can go away but of course it's looking nice like you say there's a bit of uh, GUR just down there and a little bit of square which is fine should be over that you come round this is the 18th green we've got a front flag just ahead of us that is the new hotel this is the existing that is the gym putting green halfway house slash start up first tee here we're gonna be playing off the yellows that hole back there is the third uh, dog leg this is a dog leg up to the gap and then jump down nice sort of easy start I say it's an easy start but to get through the gap is pretty challenging it's not a wide wide gap um, but I love this place I've, this is probably like my fifth time here I come here last a couple of summers ago for Wes's birthday and it was fantastic condition in the middle of the summer his birthday's in August so that was like yeah it was beautiful greens were slick really really good but I'm pretty sure it drains really well like I reckon there's a few courses close today the amount of rain we had last night but it's just really good there's some great holes lots of undulation changes there's water peppered about the place there's short holes there's long holes yeah it's it's a really good resort I think and they do great deals online as well like literally like 79 pound for a night dinner bed and breakfast round of golf like oh, yeah amazing so yeah if you uh, want a sneaky night away then this is the place to be because it is just delightful getting cold is it it's a bit nippy cool blimey <laughs> governor <laughs> yeah christ like a full wardrobe change have you just gone and bought that <laughs> 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 Um, got a sale on in the shop. Yeah, they have got yeah, a sale. Take advantage of it. Yeah. <laughs> oh, comment below. What do you think we're going to shoot today? Obviously, no, we're not taking handicaps into account. We're just playing gross. Uh, the course is harder. I think Rob would be playing off 12. I would be playing off 
15. No, actually, no you're off 11. Off, white. Off, off yellows. Off yellows, um, yeah. I'm 11, you're 15. Yeah, 15. He'd be 16 off the whites. And he would be off four. Yeah, he's just off four either way. Right? <laughs> Ridiculous handicap system. <laughs> <laughs> well, I'm going up to the Belfry next week to try and get my um, PJ card. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Finally. Finally cut down to 3.3 and he's done nothing <laughs> about it. It's just happened. Uh, good old WHS. <laughs> All right, let's uh, play some golf. Here is the first hole. 280 yards, I believe. 280 yards. Uh, yeah, like I say, it's sort of up to that gap. And then a little flick round to the corner. You can just see the people around to the right there. Uh, yeah, the green is just sort of tucked over there somewhere. So it's sort of a big fade around the corner. But uh, I'm going to go five wood, try and hit the gap. First thing of the day. Oof, she was ropey. <laughs> Yeah! Gee, you are, boy! <laughs> Let's feel a bit like that, doesn't it? Mr. P going driver. It's uh, got to be the right line. But he's a player, and that's what he's doing. Oh, that is far right. That is right. That's like over there. Well, for us to be under par, we are definitely going to have to do some <laughs> make some birdies today. <laughs> Our faith relies on you, Rob. Now, what? <laughs> you can par this first. <laughs> oh, that was awful, wasn't it? But actually, I can see the flag now, and it is just in between those two trees. I've got 220 yards, so hit a pure one of these, like the first tee, and we're laughing. Yeah, no, yeah that's fine. Anyway, they might make up and down for a par. Get the ball rolling. So actually, where Rob's hit his, so he's come up a bit short, he has got sort of a bit of a straight line straight through to the flag there. Um, Bit of creativity, I mean the trees are big. You want to go through the gap, which from his angle probably pushes him a bit right, but anywhere near is good, you know. Putting green was rolling well. Very happy with that. Yeah, nice. It was a good line, didn't see it down. Good line, mate. Okay, perfect. Yeah, that's fine. That was sort of your main option, wasn't it? It's hard to get over the trees. Yeah, agreed. Stu found his. <sighs> Stu finding his ball at the back there. Outrageous, or is he? Or is he just having a drink? A bit of refreshments. All right, so Wayne's playing his third, about 60 yards to the middle. Pin's pretty much bang on the middle. I'm going to keep working with the bump and runs if I get the opportunities to do. Playing bump and runs. Winter golf, innit? Yeah. Go on then. Did you hit your landing spot? Cool, that, that decelerated quite quickly. I think I put a lot of spin on that. <laughs> you can see the line through the dew there. That water took a lot out of it. It really slowed it up. So we didn't get Wayne's top on the first shot, on the, on the first <laughs> tee. <laughs> Apparently green doesn't mean that it's recording. Memo to self. <laughs> well, I can't believe you've over again. Green, reds, come on people. Too Don't hit me though. <laughs> yeah. oh. I'm lucky, that is four, isn't that? Par par. Rob for a bird. Bird is the word. Oh, that was a good line, wasn't it? Tried. I tried. <laughs> <laughs> oh no, I'll get this for a four, huh? Yeah, but I need one for a five. Then you're gonna have a free run at the four. Okay. And you've got a putt for four as well, Stuart. Yeah. 
Oh, I don't think so. All to play for. Steady on, Rob. Can we drop a shot in the first hole? Easy one. We haven't. That's there. not yet. Come it's, on. It's in the bag. It's in the bag. Yeah, we'll try. Oh dear. Come on, boys. Rob. With his par pat. Yes, Rob! Oh, beautiful. Level par. What a team. What a team. This is the second hole. Level par. We are level par, people. Good start. <laughs> This is a 200, no. <laughs> that is a no, it's a lot further than that. It's a 476 yard, par five. But it's all like 250 to the trees at the top end. He's hit a lovely buttery cut over those trees and hopefully just coming down the middle of the fairway. Just spot on. Yeah, go for it. Yeah. Game on now. He's doing it. Lovely. It's funny, when I play Rob in every match we've ever played, he's like, driver, don't care, driver, don't care, driver, don't care. Now we're playing in a more free role. He's like, hybrid, <laughs> free wood. <laughs> how, many, how often do we play courses with dog legs like this? Like? <laughs> yeah, well, still. You're still usually at driver. Rob on the oh, tee. He's pulled the big stick. That was kind of where I was aiming for. Just stop the top left, curl it back in. Oh, get through. Lovely. 90% air, trees. Nice. Straight down there. Wayne with the driver. Oh. Pulled it a bit left. About there, but there's probably a gap through. So we've got Wayne's ball just here. You can see him just sat there, right behind these trees. You're going up and over, yeah? Going that way. You've still got about 280 to the green. So what, you're going up, up the line of these trees, are you? Yeah, actually, there's a pretty decent line up through there. Get through. All oh, right, clipped. Just clipped to the top. I didn't see it drop. But it literally, yeah, it, it was hard, just it? one of those little ones up there. It's just a fairly, fairly light clip, but it might just drop down the other side. Okay, I am safe, but I still got a good 200 yards, I think. Yeah, I have. We got 215. Clip the train came down. Stuart's 235 here. And he's gone freeward. He's hugging the right side. Oh, it's gone in the trees. Did it come out? I did not see it out. That's what he's aiming at, anyway. Oh dear, that's a shame, isn't it? Rob hitting a lovely drive up the left-hand side there. That, oh, sorry, far side. Very nice. Yeah, Rob's going for it. He's obviously got less than Stu. I don't know what his yardage is. But you've got to go for it. It's par five totally reachable you know you might play a par I think of it is you might play a par three that's 220 yards so if you've got an approach 220 then you're going for it right it makes total sense to me oh, he's hit that is left that's down towards the tees over there but it's safe, you know? That is a safe zone to be. <laughs> oh, God. <laughs> well, this has to be good then. Hilarious. Oh, that starts to become nice. Golf, am I right? I feel like I need the pressure of match play. 
to help me perform. <laughs> Yeah, oh, what a result that is. Literally bounced out the trees back into play. It's got 65 yards in. Rob is down at the bottom of the hill there. I think... Did they sneak on? No, I don't think they did. Oh, that's a penetrator. Bite, bite! Oh, I just trickled off the bat there. Unlucky, mate. Unlucky! Did he? Yes, he did. Oh, stop it. Oh, naughty, naughty ball. Shot, mate. The mine's just come up short. I need to go in for par. Right. A bit rubbish. Plenty of green to work with. Fit and two. Pop it up and get it on. <laughs> You've fallen back as well. You can film me. Good filming. I don't know if you saw the duff, but I definitely duffed one. And then uh, I put one on the green. But it ain't great, is it? Ain't great at all. Ay, ay, ay. How can you go from playing good golf to such bad golf? Oh, good putt, mate. Good that was, man. That was a naughty par. Well, yeah. well, you would have saved par with that. It's par five. Oh, that would have been a birdie then. <laughs> <laughs> Gonna say. Sure. Good That's par, good. mate. It's par again. You got a free run at this, Stu. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, good par, mate. Be happier. Be happier. Be happier. He's got a free run and he hasn't even hit it here. Still, level par through two. Good work, boys. You're level par through two. <laughs> Rather annoyingly, the rain has turned up. Very annoying. <laughs> Cracking par four, though, this. It's one of the lower indexes. I think that's good. Yeah. Just to the right of the tree? Left of the tree, says. And there's somewhere, on the right. you can see, that's the green right in the distance, there's a valley just after that, which is just delightful. Oh, rip. Didn't see that, off into the rain somewhere. Is that good? Yeah. Sue's got a smile on his face, happy. he's happy. Right. Oh, I don't know where all this rain came from, it's not very nice. Oh, I know, that's because the Met Office told me it wasn't going to rain. I got shorts underneath there because of that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, but you've also got a woolly hat and full waterproofs. So you're covered for everything. Go on in, Wayne. It's getting heavier. Straight down the middle, bit of fade. Up towards the tree there somewhere. Pretty good, pretty good. Well, at least it's not cold today. It is wet. Frustrating. I've put the main camera away to try and protect it. I used the GoPro for a bit. Content's never as good with the GoPro, I'm afraid, but hopefully we can still get some shots, some angles, and uh, yeah, fingers crossed we can conjure something up. Um, Terrible start for me, innit? I, I didn't warm up today, I just turned up, I was running a bit short. I wanted to hit the nets, but the nets aren't near the first green, and I was like, Whoa. I'll just go putt. Putting's fine. <laughs> uh, but yeah, I'm trying to emulate the new swing whilst playing, which is a shame, but there's no pressure on it, so it doesn't matter. But it would be nice to get a couple of good ones away, you know? This is this such a shame because I want to show you this course in all its glory. This is the first course uh, I did the par threes. I vlogged the par threes back in the day when I was just vlogging individual holes. And um, it's got a lot of views. They've got a lot of views, but they are very old. There's some of my highest viewed videos. People are obviously searching for old thorns a lot. 
Looks like I'm tucked under this tree. Is that me under the tree? That's it. Yeah, it's a good dry spot. Yeah, yeah very nice. Clever, aren't I? You GoPro. I am GoPro now. But you can hold the GoPro if you wish. So here's Wayne under the tree. We've got a little bit of shelter from the rain. It's quite nice. Clever. 215 yards into the green. Long way. Seems like the guys that have just finished are just huddling by the side of the green. Oh, Wayne. He literally just hit the tree and got us both soaking wet. <laughs> <laughs> We're sheltered. <laughs> I get probably free relief from these animal. Definitely animal scratchings. Yeah. yeah. I mean, look. I let's face it. Down. That's definitely an animal, right? Really Without a doubt, that's animals. So yeah, out there on the fairway. No, it's probably here, isn't it? <laughs> as long as your feet aren't in a hole. You alright with that? Yes. Yeah, yep. Yeah. Don't hit the tree again. <laughs> <laughs> Come on then, golf ball. Foot's in a hole again. Oh dear. <laughs> Nailed it. A little bit of fade on it. You're not going to see this because we've got no zoom, but he's just gone right of those two bunkers. Just on the hill there. All good. Advanced. Yep. Well, he was laughing at me when I had a rain glove on earlier. I like a soggy leather glove. Who doesn't? <laughs> 190 yards into a green. Straight down there. Hybrid in hand. Oh, he's nailed it, but that is leaking right. And that's coming down around about here on the bottom of the bank. In the trees. Yeah, I sort oh, of. I struck that quite well as well. Did. Started on the right side and just leaked away, yeah. didn't that? <laughs> Unlucky, mate. Mr. P going big, catching the slope. Oh, he's right at the bottom of it because he's a player. Although, it's down in the valley, it could get a bit muddy down there. It could, but I'd rather be down there with a preferred yeah, lie. Being in an animal hole up there. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Very nice, Mr. Pearson. Giving himself a great opportunity. Time, time for Pearson to get birdie now. Yeah. Get us under par. Oh, that'd be nice, wouldn't it? Yeah. Would be nice. We sort of missed a couple of birdie ball holes. Birdie ball. Birdie ball holes. I didn't realise mine was birdie ball because I thought it was part four. <laughs> yeah. Mr. P, great spot, man. Great hit. If you're on the fairway there, you can place. Oh yeah, it's dropping from the. Uh... Yeah, but you get place. You can place the ball, can't you? There you go. Tee it up, darling. <laughs> <laughs> Mm, flag is just up the there. Hopefully you can see that just to the left edge of those bunkers. 125 is the yardage. Oh yeah, good hit. That's straight out of the flag, guys. Oh, one bounce and the bounce even bounced towards the flag. Come on, Mr. P. I wonder if I'll come in on a hole today. Fine. Fingers, I might chip in. You never know, I might chip in. We need to. We're going to go in after nine. It's too bad. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> At least we'll be under a hundred if we go in after nine. Yeah. Fingers crossed. I think that's a record. <laughs> uh, be our personal best. Yeah. Okay. I don't know if you can quite see the top of the flag, but it's up there. We've got 30, 40 yards to the flag. I'm going to try and hit 56 and just dink it on. Here. Right over the bunker. The bunkers are pretty severe. I reckon they're pretty new as well. Need to pick it up, we think Stu might be close. I haven't seen the green yet. Oh, nice. Need to release a bit. Could be okay. Could be okay. Rob looking for his ball. Over there somewhere. Looking you that far, Rob. Mr. Pearson with a birdie putt. Not that much of a lefty right through the line. Yeah. Is that past you? Yeah. Tapping past. Tap, tap. Good on, mate. Level pass. Tough hole to get through there. Yeah. Getting it harder. Still a bogey for me, which is no shame on that tough hole. 
but still level par as we move on to a lovely par 3.